in that case, let's go to the twins. And the twins are pretty close to the sun, I think. Oh, that, that, there they are, right? I'm guessing since this one gets filled up with ash, then there will be like something to check before the ash is like... Before it's full of ash? Oh god. Oh, that's closer than I thought. Mm, perfect landing. And I didn't find signal. Distress beacon. Ah, okay. We found one on the hollow... On the brittle hollow. Initial things first. Is everyone unarmed? Sorry, is everyone unharmed? <laughs> everyone survived the crash. Were you able to find the other escape pods' distress signals? I can hear both signals somewhere in this star system, but I don't believe either escape pod crashed on the same planet as us. So the things left to find are third escape pod. I don't think we've seen a f the third one. And the main ship was like consumed by the vines, right? Descend into the caves to look for a shelter site. We can mark our findings on the walls to avoid becoming irreversibly lost. Be aware of the sand as you search. It appears to be rising gradually. Uh oh. All right, this one sounds like the first one to try, so let's go. To reach the shelter site, walk forward until you meet the sandfall at the pit, then turn left, continue to the room filled with rock column formations, and climb upward for the opening above them. You mean like up there? Is this what you mean? What? Once on the far side, look for the tunnel hidden behind the falling sun. Follow it and you'll reach the shelter site. Oh, okay. All oh, right, yeah. Go. Hi, cactus. You're doing well. There's only a little further left. <laughs> I'm quite sure you skipped the rock formation room. Oh, I, I thought that was the rock formation room. You're doing well. There's only a little further left to go now until you reach the shelter site. You can rest there. Hurry before the sun comes. All right, hi, Cactus. So... Oh, go up, right? Some... Oh, okay. No! No, no, no! No, I was doing so well! Help! Help! Okay, uh, land, 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 land. Let's try this again. Oh, that's so much boost! Mm. Okay, uh... I'm getting buried alive. But the upside is... Eventually this would lift me up out of here, right? Because I can't really move and I don't see what I was supposed to do. Do I go behind it somehow? No, I... No, here? Oh, here! Right, maybe? Uh... Yup. Hmm? Oh, we have lights! Oh my god, let's go! No, 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 come back. Uh, high Energy Lab Trailhead, Eye Shrine District, Stepping Stone District, Anglerfish Overlook District. I want to see the High Energy Lab now. That sounds fancy. Quick! Open it, open it! Come on, let me in, let me in. It's the high energy lab, sure. Oh god, how fast do you have to be? Jesus Christ. Uh, do I just go? Like it's filling up as we speak. Did I just make a circle? Did I just go all the way around? Or is it still something? I feel like I turned back around. Maybe? I don't know, we'll see. No, this is a dead end. The cable is going straight to a wall. Can I jump over these? Okay. Okay, cable, cable. Keep on going. Fast! No, there's nothing here! Is there something he No? Ah! <laughs> no, there's no way to go! Okay, well... I... This is confusing. This is like very hard to do. I... I don't get it quite... quite. But hey, we died in a new way. Got slowly crushed to death, so that's something, right? Okay, let's see. 
That's... What? I mean, that's an achievement. <laughs> I, I guess that's an achievement, right? <laughs> huh. I... I <laughs> that went well. Don't even bother with the lights. Okay. Perfect. Okay, come on. We follow the cable. We follow the cable. We follow the cable. We're slowly getting crashed, but we follow the cable. No! Uh, I did a bad. I probably die here now, huh? Is there any exit? I don't think there's an exit. Well, I was going fast, but ow, that's um, that's not good. Can get to the other side. Come on. No, that's how do you get through that? Okay, come on. We just have to get to the other side. God damn it! Yeah, I should try to get through this before the sun gets here. But I don't think it's possible in any way. Right? Right? This should be good. No, this shouldn't be good. <laughs> That's very bad, actually. I changed my mind instantly. No, I did bad. I did bad again. Can I go, please? Okay, run. Follow the cable. That's... Uh, yeah, go over the cacti. Go, go, go. No passage here, right? Yeah, no here. Uh, left through here. Yeah, cactus, cacti. Let's go. Cable. <gasps> okay. What the hell is this place? Is this the lab? No, follow the cable. Keep on following. Oh, but you don't want me. Accept me, father. Wait. <laughs> now I'm just gonna... What happens now? Okay, well... I don't see any... Hmm. Oh, is there like some quicker entrance to here? No, it's just an exit. Right? Yeah, it's really... Exit to the top. Okay. I mean, I went fast, but I went too fast, and there was no way to pass yet, so... Go there? Okay. Go! No! God damn it! Go! Maybe oxygen? Yes, oxygen! Just in time. Ooh! Hello! May I get some writing explaining what's going on here, because I don't know... If I should just pressing start pressing buttons. Okay. <gasps> this is where the cables come from. Oh my god. Records show Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the White Hole station. Raimi and I are devising an experiment to test if this is a real phenomenon or simple machine error. Our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole core with a small white hole core to mimic the setup on the white hole station. Hypothesis. It is possible for an object to exit a white hole before entering the correspond corresponding black hole. So they accidentally discovered time travel? I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eyes. To that end, we've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City's energy supply should provide sufficient. The Sovereign Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. Hypothesis. Creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, but we are currently unable to generate the necessary energy. We would also likely need an enormous space to fit these propose proposed new energy and warp technologies together. The only location large enough would be Ash Twin. The Ash Twin project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically. What if we use warp towers, like the one we have on the Whitehall station, to connect Ash Twin directly to each critical location? My gratitude to those who noted my imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. 
I believe this has been sufficiently clarified. Kindly stop reminding me. <laughs> this is power, right? This is something. I put the power here. Does the power for the whole thing? Okay. This is warp cores. This is white hole core. Uh, wait. Right? And this is a black hole? Okay. Oh my god! I mean, yeah, obviously. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Huh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well. Thank you guys so much for watching my playthrough of the Outer Wilds. Uh, we have destroyed the fabric of space-time, so yeah, that's... I think that's a fantastic conclusion to the whole story. <laughs> See, this is what I was talking about. The soundtrack of this game is just magnificent.